Mm. I love chocolate so good. Hey everybody, welcome back to more. <clears throat> Let's play Phantom Hourglass. In the last episode, we came to Mercury Island. And I need to get my stylus out. Yeah, that would be a good thing to do. And in this episode, we're gonna hopefully go look for some sound to go shit. So... Andy, chocolate, it's good. Anyway, so now that that's over, um, yeah. Come over here, and there is this little Mr. Tablet guy. It's an iPad! Wayfair's words, no dot for. What a discovery. On the Isle of Gus, the temple re- now there's four of these tablets scattered throughout the island. One's like here, one's like here, one's like here, one's like here. I don't care about their exact location, but what I want to do is draw a line between them. Connecting them like that. You know, this took me forever to figure out when I first played it, but rupees. And if you notice, I have way more rupees than before. That's because off camera I got... Three big green rupees, one was right here, one was in the cave we saw, and then one was later on. And I also bought the wisdom gem from Beetle that I didn't get before. And go look at Have to make Josh Jefferson happy about those angles. So you dig where the lines intersect, and there's a hole in the ground. There's a cave. To my son, Romanos. If you are reading these words, you have found my true hideaway. Which means you also have developed a desire to find your own way in life. Know that I am truly sorry for putting you and your mother through so much. I am well aware that I am the world's worst father, leaving you both behind. There is so much about the ways of the world I don't understand. Such as why the ghost ship appears at Steel Speeper. Where do the victims go? HELL! I have decided to dedicate my life to finding out the answers. If I fail to return, please take care of your mother, and please forgive me. I'm closing one more thing. Embrace your wafer and ways, my son. That sounded cool and stuff. Barrels! Do a barrel roll! You found a treasure map! <laughs> that was a loud burp. <laughs> well, I think you might have competition, Nintendo Capri son. I, well, I just outburped you in a let's play. Swirly to my son. Swirly. Here's the only way to sail through a foggy passage. Okay, so all I know is I already have that down from when I went through here before. And anyway, there's like a big green ruby in here somewhere if you dig around. See, I already had that route written down. Can you believe that? I already had that route written down. Ow. No, choo choo, no. Choo choo, why you no stop being electrical and zapping me? Die. So now we're gonna go and, like, go do that thing that's called sailing through the fog. Do, do, do. Ba da ba 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 da ba 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 ba. You have a pinhead and purple hair. Hey, Line Beck, how's it going? What? You actually know how to reach the northern sea? The route was written on a map. Please tell me you wrote it on a sea chart. Um, yes. How about we shove off then? The fog awaits. Choo choo! I don't know why I did that. This isn't spirit tracks. But let's go to the north! And pull up these bomb barrels so we don't die. Ribbit, ribbit. Do, 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 do. 
Da 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 ba. Do. We're going to David Jones' locker. Oh, Ichigo, stop mes messaging me. Ichigo, why you no go record Ocarina of Time? Or, whatchamacallit, not Skyward Sword, Soul Silver. Why don't you go do that? And not message me while I'm recording. No silly Ichigo and recording while messaging. Messaging while recording. And I messed up my angle. So I actually know this route through the fog off the top of my head, so. If you ever meet me at a convention like PAX East or something, I can name the route right off the top of my head. Yeah, there's a lot of enemies in the fog here. Um, actually, what I might just do is cut this out because it's just sailing and shooting stuff, so. Yeah, I'll probably cut it out. Flying fish, go bye bye. Bombs, boom. It's probably be about long, hopefully longer than 10 minutes at least. Die, Ocean Octorok. Well, that's a close up of a bomb barrel. Yeah, I don't know what the, like, the margin of error is for like the route, like how far off you can go from the actual course, but I don't know if, if there's even a such thing. Hey, Beetle, how's it going? Oh, that's the first time I haven't seen the gold helmet up here, and the first time through. The gold helmet's back from Wind Waker. As you know, the gold helmet shot Beetle, sell, sold a lot of good things, piece of heart, bottle, Etc. Etc. Yeah. Like here, I don't know if you could like cut across from here across, but I don't know. I never tried that. I might try that off camera or something, but no, no. Stylus get out of my sock. I don't know. Maybe we'll try that. Actually, what we're gonna do instead go into that island right now. Gonna go to the traveler ship and like go do stuff there because. We should. No, go bye bye, Mr. Fish. You turn into John Rupee. Hi, Mr. Rock. Bye, Mr. Rock. Uh, hard turn to port. Here's a whole side quest we could go do, but so long, it'll probably take up a whole episode. Um, yeah, I won't do that right now, I guess. We'll do what is I plan on doing. Which is the traveler ship in this sector because there's one in each area. Enemy ahead! This one's different! Okay. Here we are, there's like open seas and stuff, which is cool. I like me some open seas. Do you like some open seas? Because I like open seas. And that fish guy is still there. Hey, wait, isn't that... Isn't that... It's the King of the Red Lions! It is, isn't it? It is! Something like, I guess, much bigger, or we're just smaller. <laughs> Say, I can't help but notice. You're dressed exactly like me. Are you a fan of mine? No, you just look like one of Santa's elves. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, it doesn't surprise me in the least to meet a fan. That voice is weird. 
I travel around the world on the ship to Prince the Red Lions to save all things from evil. When you have crows around you and they're like a symbol of evil. Yes. Don't tell me you're the toilet paper dude. Sarigi, huh? Sarigi, you're now here as a apprentice. Hey, help. I almost said amen. <laughs> Study and learn the ways of dashy ways are about. Yes. Ow, ow, ow. Did, that didn't count. I'm going with too easy on you. You got Princess Rudo's crown. Zoras have passed it down for generations. Um, we can't do that yet? Huh? Um, why can't we do that yet? Um, yeah, you get it? Oh, okay, duh, we have... What the hell am I thinking? Yes. Yeah, duh, what, why didn't I think of that? You have to leave the ship and come back. Yes. <laughs> now you want to get a hundred hits on him. I have actually got 999 before. I guess you can't. You got... Why do you have so many Rudos crowns? I don't get that. I thought I was the one married to her. Nice blow. Blow him up, jeez. Yes. Hit, 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 hit. There's crows around the edge. Helmrock plume. <laughs> Burp. Now we have a health meter, which means we can't get hit more than three times. Ow. First time. Ha! I dodged you. How does that feel to be dodged? Oh, no, 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 uh, this isn't a good situation right now. Ha. Huh. Come on. Dodge. Iggy, use double team. It's super effective. Come on. Something tells me I'm like going to die at 99 hits or... 89 almost. No! Come on! You suck up. Yes. I hate minigames in Zelda. Fifteen. Sixteen. Seventeen. Eighteen. Nineteen. Twenty. Twenty-one. Twenty-one. Thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven. I can't even way ahead of myself. Three, thirty, thirty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, fifty, fifty-one, fifty-two, fifty-three, fifty-four, fifty-five, fifty-six, fifty-seven, fifty-eight, fifty-nine, sixty, sixty-one, sixty-two, sixty-three, sixty-four, sixty. 66, 67, 68, 69, yay. Ow. 
70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77. 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. Okay, hit me. Hit me. Hit me. Remarkable. Hit it. You got a heart container! Your life energy has increased by one, and your heart's been refilled. That's gonna do it for this episode, and the next one, we will head to the Isle of Gust, and proceed with some gusto. Okay, see you guys then.